everybody. I uh, wanted to share wanted to share with my friends here um, a new guitar that I I recently picked up and give you a little background here. This is um, this is my D forty one Martin that um, picked up from a pawn shop a couple years ago, and I thought to myself. Somebody must have been really down and out to sell this this beautiful guitar. Um, it's all worn out over here from you know from the guy uh, his armpit. But what a gorgeous top! Somebody told me this is an Ad Adirondack top. I don't think it is, although it has kind of a reddish hue to it. I think it's Sitka. But look at the the inlay here of this D41 and the. Uh, the the pearl inlay here on the on the uh, fretboard absolutely beautiful sound it's just aged it's very very it's like a it's like a like a buttery chardonnay wine This is a, a custom HD28 that I had made personally and has a little snowflake bridge, has a, a flower, flowery, floral, 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 floral pickguard, and a torch, torch martin top here, which these are all from old Martins from the 20s and the 30s that I just kind of brought together and with an Adirondack top uh, very simple it has Eastern uh, Indian rosewood long story about this guitar the gu guitar was damaged and I wouldn't say damaged it was not a perfect guitar Martin made it right after 30 years I can't believe it and anyway but so basically this is a 30 year old guitar that has been basically redone but it's got some new tuners here shallower tuners but listen listen to the sound on this guitar absolutely gorgeous high-end instruments uh, that are Sure is that better than, than I am as far as a, a musician is concerned. But here's what I wanted to share with everybody. This is a guitar I just picked up. It's got the little snowflake bridge. It's got a Dalmatian pickguard. The abalone inlay goes entirely around the guitar and the heel, just like a, a Martin D45. But the fretboard is like my D41. And there's a snowflake bridge bridge like my custom. And look at this. It's got a it's got this torch headstock. So somebody from the Aria Guitar Company put this guitar together. And for some reason they had the same idea in their mind to incorporate little bits of the best of Martin guitars, but it even gets better. This is an Engelman uh, spruce top. Look at how beautifully tight grain and white that is. And, and look at this. That's Brazilian rosewood. So this is the best of the, and look at the mahogany of that, uh, of the, um, Look at the mahogany here on the on the uh, the top here. So basically, you have the best materials that are put together, and obviously there was a master a master guitar builder. Here. Okay, I'm going to shut down. I'm going to come back, and I'm going to show you young people that the guitar is as good as the guitar needs better. Your instrument needs to be better than what you are. Okay.